Installation and Connections. The first thing we need to do is get power to your keyboard. And basically we have two options here. One, the power adapter. One end plugs into the DC in jack and the other end into your wall outlet. And for people on the go, you can actually use batteries. We do ask that you consult your manual, though, for the battery type and the installation. Now, please note, Yamaha only recommends genuine Yamaha adapters. And on this model here, we'll be using the Yamaha PA3 series. While we're here, we can see that there's some other jacks on the back panel. Like the sustain jack, you can use an optional Yamaha FC4 or FC5 sustain pedal. And what this does is it emulates the right pedal or the damper pedal on a real acoustic piano. And this is great for those of you who might be taking piano lessons. This is the headphones out jack. This allows us to do two things. This is where we can plug our headphones in, or we can take an output to an external system, like your stereo. Please note, the moment you plug your headphones in, power to the speakers shuts off. This is normal. This allows you to practice in private and totally undisturbed. And last, these two jacks are the MIDI input and the MIDI output jacks, but we'll talk about this a little later on. Now, let's start exploring your keyboard.